So I'm gonna go back to the main menu and uh, let's goof around a little. Well, first of all, I'm gonna save it. So here's uh, the card options. This is we haven't touched this. I'm going to store all my work. So everything everything I've done right now, uh, if I turned off the Game Boy or if I close the emulator, it all disappears. It's not saved. So think of this as uh, you're playing Pokemon. You're playing an old Pokemon game, and you capture a bunch of Pokemon, and then you just turn off the Game Boy or the battery dies or whatever. Uh, you never press save, which means uh, the next time you turn it on, it'll be back at uh, the last time you saved. So this is what this bu this button does. This is, do you want to save your game? This is, do you want to save your sound? So I'm going to store it in uh, SRAM or save RAM. Uh, start. Do you really want to overwrite it? Uh, yes, I do, especially considering that it's empty right now. So yes. All right. It's been saved. And likewise, when I go to load this up next time, uh, this editor will start empty until I load it from SRAM. All right. So yeah, let's goof around with some uh, block commands because we didn't touch on these. So I'm going to go back up to the block editor and I'm going to look at block one. I'm sorry, the first block, block zero. And this is our intro. Great. Uh, let's go back and let's see what we have here. We've already done copy, paste, paste channel. Let's try, oh, swap channel one and two. This is very simple. Um, so I'm going to press start. The channels have now been swapped. Okay, great. Now if I look at it again, uh, eh, it's kind of hard to see, but yes, two, channel one and channel two have been swapped. Now why would I want to do this? Um, well, so both channels are extremely similar. Channel one and channel two, they both play the same sounds. Uh, channel one, I believe has some special functionality like uh, sweeps, uh, being able, you know, droop, that kind of stuff. Uh, one of the channels does, so that might be a reason. You have, uh, you might be doing stuff in one channel and think, oh crap, I wanted a special effect in that channel, so uh, uh, I gotta swap them. Um, yeah, and likewise, if you are making a video game and you want sound effects, most video games have sound effects, and you only got four four channels to play sounds on. And if you need the sound effects played in, uh, let's say, channel two, and you've got a bunch of, you got your melody playing there, and crap, I don't want, uh, I don't want the melody to get, you know, to pause just to hear a sound effect, because that really throws off the music. Then you might consider swapping it. So that'd be another reason to swap channels. Uh, I don't have a reason to change. I'm just goofing around, so I'm gonna swap, put it back, swap them back, boop. All right. Uh, let's see what else is here. Transpose up, transpose down. So it currently sounds like this. So I can use this button to transpose the entire block up. Let's do it twice. And that's because it's transposing by semi semitone. So this is like transposing up to a sharp, I guess, is a way to put it. I'm gonna do one more. Okay, now let's hear what it sounds like. <laughs> cool. All right, actually, let's put it back. I'm going to transpose down twice, put it back where it was. All right. Now let's have a little fun. Let's uh, let's do a key change. Everyone loves key changes. So I'm going to go back to my block editor, and this is block zero, and I'm going to cycle through my blocks. There's block one, or the ending of the song, and then if I go up again, Block two is empty because I didn't make anything past this. All right, I'm going to copy and paste block zero and two. I'm sorry, block zero and one. I'm going to copy zero to two because it's empty. And I'm going to copy one to three. And I'm going to do that just so I can implement a simple key change just for fun. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to go back and I'm going to copy to buffer. Okay, block zero has been copied. Now this is empty. I like to always double check it's empty before I paste uh, because oh, I should have been emphasizing more. There is no undo in this program. There is no undo. So uh, save every once in a while and especially save state. I like to save state because I'm using an emulator to save state. All right, paste. Make sure you don't screw anything up. 
All right, there's block two. It's now a copy of block zero. And likewise, I'm going to copy one and paste it, this is empty, to the empty block three. Paste. All right, and now I'm going to do some simple key changes. Transpose up, transpose up. Okay, and then number three. Now actually, let's look at it. So you can see right here, it's actually, it's not, uh, it's actually literally changing the notes. So the first starting note here is an F3. So if I transpose up, it's now an F sharp three. And transpose up again, it's now a G3. Cool. Now let's go back to our block order list and implement it. Two and three and oops, end. All right, cute. Uh, it's actually a little long, so I'm going to cut out this. Uh, it kind of ends twice, so I'm going to cut out this one in the middle. So as you can see in the bottom right corner, I can press A and B at the same time, just like in all the other screens, to delete. Uh, this one's a little unique in that when I delete, it actually uh, cuts out the step entirely, and it does not leave a space. So I'm going to cut that out. Boop. And I can always insert spaces. So if I, uh, what was it? There we go. I'm going to hold either A or B. It doesn't matter. I'm going to hold A, and it, sa it says I can press select to insert. Select, 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 select. It's just inter inserting a bunch of threes. <laughs> I'm going to delete those all. Boop. So that's how you insert sounds, or insert blocks. All right. Is that it? I think I'm done. Let's listen. I accidentally started again. Oh man, this is fun. Block editor. Go back down to zero. Sound zero. Bum 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 bum. Is this gonna be stupid? <laughs> What's this sound like? <laughs> Just a little lead into the next section. <laughs> 